Welcome to a new video lecture. Today we will discuss a problem related with the influence line diagram. So please note down the question. A single point load of 24 kN is moving from left to right on a simply supported beam of span 12 meter. Then calculate, first one is shear force at a section 3 meter from left support and second one is maximum bending moment at a point 3 meter from left to support and the load for third question is the load position and the value of maximum bending moment in the beam. Okay, so in the given question a simply supported beam is given which is span length is 12 meter and a 24 kilo newton is traveling from this left side to the right side and the question given that we have to find out the shear force at a distance 3 meter from the left to support when this 24 kilo newton load reaches the point 3 meter from this point then how to find out the shear force and we know that using our influence line diagram we already find out when 1 kilo newton travels from this throughout the beam okay so with the help of that diagram we will also calculate the shear force so we already derived this equations and formulas using this influence line diagram and here the maximum negative shear force value will be set by L and here the maximum positive shear force value is going to be L minus Z by L and here Z means this distance of this shear force point and here so you can find out that 3 by 12 equals 1 by 4 and here L minus Z means the remaining distance will be 9 so 9 by 12 and finally you will get 3 by 4 so for find so this is the case for 1 unit load okay so you have to find out for this 24 kilo newton then you have to multiply the value of this 3 by 4 multiplied by 24 and this 1 by 4 multiplied by 24 so that is shown here so maximum negative shear force value is going to be minus 6 kilo newton and maximum positive value is going to be 18 kilo newton okay so then coming to the maximum bending moment at the section 3 meter you can easily find out that this is the equation, general equation for one unit load. So, if you substitute the value, you finally get 3 multiplied by 9 by 12. Then, after that, you have to multiply with the 24. That is the given value. So, finally, you will get 54 kilo newton meter. Then, the third question is that in the beam where the maximum bending moment will occur. The second question is that at the point 3 meter only. So, the third question is asking that to find out at which point the maximum value is going to happen. The maximum value will have occur at the center of the beam. So that is 6 meter from each support. So if you substitute the value, in this case the set value is going to be 6. Okay. And L minus is also 6 and total span is 12 and finally it is 3. So, the absolute maximum bending moment value is going to be 3 multiplied by 24 and finally you will get 72 kilo newton meter. So, this is the case related with a, a point load acting over a beam. Okay. So, using influence line diagram we can find out the shear force and the bending moment. Okay. So, this is for today's section. Thank you.